Hi, I'm Donna Richardson, and this is 30 Days to Firmer Abs and Arms. I designed this workout especially for you. You know, I talk to my girlfriends and my mom and people just like yourself. You let me know what's important in a good workout. I've combined fat-burning aerobics and some great muscle conditioning exercises to help you see results in 30 days. Are you ready? Let's get it going on. Okay, let's shape it up with my 30 days to firmer abs and arms. Are you ready at home? Are you all ready? We're gonna warm you up. I have my friends here, Kat and Tara. You know we gotta warm you up. Warm up the muscles, elevate the heart rate, and then you wanna stretch those muscles out because you gotta get yourself prepared for some action, right? I want you to practice good alignment. Hold the abdomen in, chest up, shoulders stay down and back. We're gonna start marching on seven and then tapping on eight. March, there go March. Tap it in, uh-uh. Now we're gonna add some arms, shoulder to hip, really slow, look. Shoulder to hip, now out to the side, and take it down, left side. We're gonna practice that two more times. Shoulder hip, shoulder hip, side, and down. Take it at tempo, one on each side, look. March it out, left side, you got it. Let's try that again. Shoulder hip, and march and shoulder hip, and march. Come on, we gotta warm it up in here. Are you all ready? Instead of the march, two step taps to the right. Two step taps, lead left. Two step taps, you can make this funky, look at this. All right, I hear you, cat. Adding arms, when you do your step tap, shoulder roll, and then arm circle overhead. Shoulder roll and circle. Make sure you got that abdomen in, right? We're gonna add some direction, move up on the right. Spice it up, let me see you at home. Have a little fun with this. Move it up on the right, let's go. Pump it up, pump it up, hey. Oh, come on. Prepare for a change, march it out, right, left. Let me see some energy here. There you go, come on. Double tap, right and left, double tap. Now just pump it up, shake it up, shake it down. Combination, four count march and two taps. March, two, three, four, and tap. Hey, ho! We're gonna add some sexy arms with the double tap. Cross over and then hold your buds. Uh-huh, hold what you got, come on. Now walk it around for four counts, walk. Sexy walk, come on. Pump it up, pump it up. I said sexy, give it up.
Round it up. Lengthen it out. You got to warm up the large muscle groups now. Give it to me one more time. Now come all the way up. Bring your knee in. Take it back. Just let your shoulders groove. You should feel the stretch in your calf muscles. Oh, it feels so good. Now from here, bend down. Slight pelvis rotation. Feel that stretch in your thigh. Just shake it up. Shake it down. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Bring it in. Stretch back and lower down. Bending at the hips. Flex the toe. Now place it down. You round it up and lengthen it out. Very nice. It feels so good. Come all the way up. Bring that back leg in. Get into our groove thing here. Tailbone down. Chest up, shoulders down and back. Now hold it here. You lower down. Slight pelvis rotation. Feel that stretch in your quadricep muscle group. Jam in, jam in. Uh-huh, uh-huh. How we doing? Are you ready? Are you ready? Four more right here. Bring your feet together and march it out right, left, right now. Let's go. Pump it up. And we're going to get into some spicy low impact aerobics coming at you. This is a mixed impact aerobic workout. If you prefer low impact aerobics, please follow Miss Tara. Remember to practice good alignment. Keep your abs in to protect your back. And if you're doing high impact aerobics, please get your heels down. Are y'all ready to party in here? We're going to start with a four count march right, hop to the right twice, and then take it on the left. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and hop. Now left side. Pump it up, pump it up, come on. Right side. How we doing back there? Are you okay at home? We're gonna add some arms. Right arm, then left arm, reach up. Reach it up, reach it up, and hop. That's it, left arm. Right arm goes up. Left arm goes up. We're gonna add some arms to that hop. Both arms push forward and over. Push it forward and over. Left side. I want you to add some spice. Let me see those hips. I sure do. <laughs> Left side. We're going to move it forward on the march. Right lead. Hop it out. Look. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Move it back. Can I see some spice there? Move it up. Move it back on the left. Prepare for a change. Out, out, and in on the right side. Keep it here. You're going to take it forward, forward, back, back, and in. Two more. Tap and change left. We're going to refer to this as a V-step. Come on, get funky, get busy. Two on the right, two on the left. Here we go. That's it. Take it on the left. I'm going to show you some arms for the V-step. Out, out, cross, pull, look. Out, out, cross, pull. Left side. Out, out, cross, pull. Right side. Out, out, cross, pull. Left side. Now we're going to add a little bit more here. Give me one V-step, alternate lunge, right, left. V-step, left. Alternate left, right. V step right. Alternate right, left. V step left. We're going to add some arms with the lunges. Here we go. V step first. Cross, cross, side and down. Left side. Cross, cross, side and down. That's it. Come on. Pump it up, pump it up. Hey. Oh, V step. Come on. Are you ready? Are you ready? Give it to me twice more. All right. Come on. Spice it up. From the very, very top. Are you ready for that V-step? Right side. Right lunge. Left V. Left lunge. Move it up. We're going to put it together. Right. You're going to hold it here. V-step on the left. Left lunge. Move it back on the left. Left hop. V-step on the right. Right lunge. Oh, yes. We got it together now. Move it up. Up. Hop, hop. V-step on the left. Left lunge. Lead left, move back. Come on. Are y'all having fun? V step right. Prepare for a change. Rock four, front back. Right. Rock four. Now left. That's it. Come on. Pump it up. Pump it up. Hey, ho. Come on. Party time. Are you ready for a little bit more? Three alternating front backs. Now alternate three knees. Look. Three, two, three front backs. Three knee lifts. You've got it. Come on. That's it. Work with me now. We're going to add some arms. Pop down, then arm stretches up. Alternate twice. That's it. Pop down, alternate twice. You've got it. Are you ready for a little bit more? Prepare for a change. Cross over. Four counts. Four. Over. All right, again. Take it twice more. Prepare for a change. Tap in. Left side. Look. That's it. You can make this a little jazzy. You're going to take it out, out, in, in, right four times. You've got to get down to get up. Get busy. Work, 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 work. Tap and change left side. Ow, come on. Are you okay at home? Putting it together, all right? Cross step once. Out, 
with the right. We're gonna put it together from the top. Move it up, let's go. Ha, ha, come on. Feet step on the left. Lunge it out. Move it back on the left. That's it, look, ow. Feet step right. Feet step left. Lunge it out. Feet comes up. Cross with the left. Out, out, and in. Left lead rock. Come on. 
shake it up. Ow! We're gonna take it from the top. Kick ball change. Great five. Step touch left right. Pivot. Step knee. Rock it out. Heel out. Shake it down. Again. Come on. 
don't give it up. Let me hear you say. Ah, yes. Four lunges right. Here, four, three, two. Now take it left. Four, three, two, and right. Pump it, arms down. There you go. And left. Combination coming at you. Three lunges right now. The last one, step over the top. Front. There you go. Three more. Come on, pump it up. Are you ready? We're going to put the two moves together. Go to the back. Step, one, two, three. Step, step. Now give me that little sexy move here. Look. Pow, pow. Three lunges. Let's go. Pump it up, pump it up. Step it over. Can we try it again? Boop back right now. Let's go, let's go. How we doing, Kat? Now let's hit it, hit it. Ow, I love this. Lunge aside. Come on, take it over. We're going to put it all together from the very, very top. Step heel now. All right, let me see that jerk with attitude. Here we go, look. Step heel left. Jerk left. Twist. Step, step, one, two, three. Step pivot. Attitude. Work. Lunges three times. Three, two, one, up and over. Are you ready? Are you ready? From the top. Let's go. Ha, ha. Step it out. Look. Yeah. Step heel. Jerk it out. Attitude now. Step, step. One, two, three. All right. Let me see it. Give it up, girls. Come on. Oh. Ha. Three lunges. Come on. Pump it up. later on. But what I'd like for you to do, since we've got toning coming up, I'd like for you to get your weights and mat and a chair. And let's work it out. Hey! Okay, let's tone it up. We're going to start with some exercises for your back and for your arms, because I want you to look so fit and so fabulous. I know you're ready for that, right? All right, let's get into proper position. What you're going to do is you're going to step back into a lunge. You're going to rest your elbow on the chair, lower all the way down. Now, what I want you to do is make sure your back is very straight and parallel to the floor. Your arm is extended to the side. Keep your shoulders even, abdomen in. You're going to lift up for two counts. Here we go. Lift up for two and lower down. As you lift, you want to exhale out. And as you lower, inhale. That's it. Squeeze at the top and then lower down. How are we doing? OK. Now. When you're lifting, make sure your elbow stays close in towards your side. Two more. Squeeze and lift and lower. We're going to add on to a combination, adding an elbow extension. Turn your palm forward. You lift up, extend back, bring it in, and lower down. Now we're working the back part of your arm called your tricep muscle groups. Now what you want to do here is make sure you do not lock your elbow as you extend back. Can you feel that work back there? You know, we always talk about the back part of the arms, but you got to work them. That's it. Keep your breathing going and the movements very slow and control. One more. We're going to change up. You're going to hold it here. Now slowly come up, abdomen in. Let's get the other weight. Feet hip width apart 
abdomen and press your tailbone down. Find neutral position. Shoulders press down and back. We take a lift to the front, to the side, and a shoulder press up. Are you ready? All right, here we go. And you lift up, bring it down. Lead with your elbow side. Bend it in. Press up halfway down. All the way up, all the way down. There you go. Now notice that our torso is not moving at all. You want to keep it very stationary. That's it. Lift up, breathe out. Can you feel it working? All right. Because you want some sexy shoulders now, right? Lift and lower. Lead with the elbows. And every now and then you want to make sure you're practicing good alignments. Check it out. Lift, take it down and out to the side. And up, halfway down. When you take it up, leave your shoulders down. Breathe out. Good job. Hang in there. Are we okay? Control it. No swinging. We're in control here. Take it up, halfway down. Can you give it to me one more time? Breathe out. Very small movements here. Lift up, lower down, up, and relax. Now place the weight in the chair. You know we've got to do the other side, right? I want you to step back, rest your elbow on the chair. Get into your lunge position. Make sure your back is very long and extended. Arm extended to the side. Shoulders are even. You're going to lift up for two counts. Here we go. Squeeze the muscle back. That's it. And take it down. Back muscles squeeze tightly and lower down. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. How are we doing? Are you doing okay at home? All right, come on, breathe. Take it nice and slow. All right, we're almost there. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. One more. Now turn the palm forward. Add the elbow extension. Lift, extend, bring it in, lower down. Make sure your back stays very long. And the abs have to work. That's it. I see you. Keep going. Practice that good alignment and good form. Breathe out. Can you give me just two more? Come on. Give it up. Just one more. You can thank me later. Hold here. Lift up. And we're going to go into some exercises for the front part of your arm and the back part of the arm. Okay, let's start with biceps curls. You're going to place one weight down on the floor. Bend at your hip, abdomen in. Instead of rounding forward, I want a very long extended back. Place the back of the arm against the thigh. Opposite hand on top of your thigh. You're going to lift up for one count. Breathe as you lift. Inhale as you lower. Are you ready? All right, here we go. Lift up, lower down. Remember to breathe out as you're doing the work. Now, even though it seems like we're doing a little faster than we were in the last toning segment, it's still controlled movement. And we're really focusing in and isolating the front part of the arm, the biceps. One more. Now you're going to hold it here, lift it up. Take it behind you. Slight pelvis rotation so you don't arch your back. Keep your arm close towards your ear. Now extend it up. Extend, lower down. When you're lifting, you're breathing out. And then as you lower down, inhale. The elbow should be pointed directly towards the front as opposed to going out to the side there. Very good. Can you feel it in the back part of your arm? You should feel that. Your triceps muscle group's working. One more. Now hold it here. Bring it back down in front. Place it right against your thigh and lift it up. As you lift, I want you to concentrate the wrist and the arm stays in the same line as opposed to bending. That's it. Breathe out at the top. Keep your shoulders parallel towards me. How we doing? Because you're going to have some sexy and shapely arms for those sleeveless dresses. You're going to be looking mighty fine. Hold it here. Lift it up. Readjust pelvis rotation and extend it up. Here we go. Lift and breathe. As you extend, avoid locking the elbow. So you just lengthen the arm towards the top. Stretch it up and breathe out. How we doing? Are y'all okay? Keep that arm close in towards your ear. Four more, I can feel it. One more, and relax. Place that weight down on the floor, opposite hand. 
right against your thigh. Are you ready? Lift up. Bicep curl now. Here we go. Very nice. How you doing? Okay? All right. Four more. Watch your alignment. It's very important to practice good form. Hold it here. Take the arm, extend it back, adjust your torso, and extend it up right here. Now, as you take it back, don't let the weight drop. Look, lower it down, lengthen it up. That's it. And you see the abdomen just keeps on working. Come on. Feels good? Are you breathing out with it? Come on, breathe out at the top. Two more. One more, hold it, bring it in. We're gonna do one more set. Give it up, come on. Lift it up right now. Curl it in and down. Uh-huh, this is it. It's like the cherry on top, right? <laughs> Thinking positive thoughts right now. Keep that torso very long and extended. Always practicing good form and alignment. One more, now you're gonna hold it up. As soon as you get here, adjust. There you go, shoulders down and extend it up. Lower it down. That's it. Looking good. Come on, you know we're in this together. It's called teamwork. Come on, you can do it. That's it. And again, as you get stronger, you can increase the weights or do another set. One more and relax. Place the weight down on the floor. You want to keep your weights because we're going to get into some awesome ab work. And please get your mat. Okay, let's dig into some awesome ab work and continue with upper body work. All right, I want you to find neutral position. Pull the abs in, keep the back in contact with the floor. All right, place your weights in your hands. Extend the arms right up above you in front of your chest. We're gonna open up for two. We're gonna do a fly exercise. Are you ready? Here we go. Lower it down, lift it up. Inhale as you lower, exhale as you lift. The arms stay in the same position through the entire motion. That's it. And look, squeeze your chest muscles as you close it in. Nice and slow, control. Two more. One more. Now you're gonna hold the weights right on top of your chest, lift up on one, lower down. Two, three, and four. Lift up, lower. That's it, come on. We're just saying to the abdominal muscles, wake up. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Again, you gotta breathe out as you contract, pulling the abs into the back. Just a few more. Keep your head, neck, and shoulders in the same line, curling up. Breathing out at the top. One more. Now hold it right here. Extend the arms back up above the chest. Find neutral position. Open up. Now squeeze your chest muscles and close together. Exhale as you lift. Inhale as you lower. Good job. Squeeze the chest muscles a little bit more. I'm doing good, how are you all? I know you got my back covered, right? All right, you're gonna take it one more time. Now hold, bring it in, lift it up. Lift and slowly lower down. That's it. You gotta breathe out at the top, look. Breathe out, pull in. Inhale, lower back. That's it. And you know, you do as much as you can. Feel free to stop and take a break. Because you can always pick back up, right? That's it. Pull down and in. Think of your abdominal muscles pulling into your back. One more. Hold it right here. 
extended up, palms facing forward. We're gonna do a chest press. Rotate out, bring it down. Now turn it in. Lower it down. Again, squeeze your chest muscles on the way up. Good job. All the way up, that's it. Lengthen it all the way in front of your chest. Rotate and extend up. One more. Bring the weights back in front of the chest. I want you to lift up. Now you're gonna take it side to side. All right, here we go. Shoulder towards the knee. Breathe out at the top. Heels pressing into the chair. We're gonna get into the nitty gritty of things. Come on. Breathe out, breathe out. Now lift, knee towards the chest. Lift, now opposite knee. Pull in, breathe out. Curl it forward. That's it. Two more. We're gonna go back to side to side right now. Here we go. You lift and curl. We're working those side muscle groups, the internal and external oblique muscles. And you're just gonna lift and turn. Keep that back in contact with the floor. Four more. Now lift the knee up. Here we go. Lift, slow and control making sure that we do exercises that are safe and effective because you want results, right? You want to be looking mighty fine. Again, one more and place the weights down to the side. Very nice. Now you're going to lift your heels one at a time off the chair. You're going to cross at the ankles. We're going to do a reverse curl. Relax your shoulders. Pull down and in one count. Lift and lower. Now you really have to concentrate on contracting your ab muscles. And when you lower down, you wanna lower. Don't let the hips rock forward and back. It's control. Place the hands behind the head, contract, come on, twice. Lift up, contract two times, and lower. Reverse curl, contract for two, and lower. Lift it up, curl in for two counts, and down. I'm feeling it. You ready for what? I hear you. <laughs> Two more. One more. Hold it here, relax. Stretch your legs up, flex your toes. One knee at a time, you're gonna pull it in. Pull in, breathe out. Now, if you're just beginning, you're not gonna lift your hips up. Keep your hips down. You want to curl up, shoulder towards the knee, as opposed to elbow to knee. Abdomen in, and you're going to lift and turn. Nice job. Come on. Yes, it is. I'm feeling it. Remember, this is teamwork now. All right. You can give me a few more, right? Pull down and in. One more. Relax, hold here, one heel at a time. Place it on the chair. Extend the arms out, but if you're just starting, follow Tara, abdomen in, one count up and down. Here we go, lift and lower. All right, now we're working longer lever. It's a little bit more challenging because we have more weight to lift up against gravity but you wanna make sure the abdomen is working. You're contracting in, breathing out at the top. That's it. One more, hold it here. Now just contract. Oh, bring it on home. Come on, tighten it a little bit more. Come on, four more right here. That's it, all right, and relax. All right, that was my favorite part of the workout, but the cool down is my absolute favorite. Let's cool it down. My second favorite part of the workout. Take a deep breath in and out. Press the shoulders down and back. That's it. We're gonna pull the knee into the chest and we're gonna stretch right through the buttocks. Hold right here. Extend that leg out to the front and hold. You should feel the stretch underneath the thigh. Take a deep breath in and out. 
We're going to lift the leg and hold it up. Lift and hold. And lower down. Lift and hold. And lower. One more time. Lift, hold right here. Press your shoulders down. Slowly circle the foot around. Reverse curve. Hold it here. Bend your leg. Knee turned out. Place the hand underneath and around the foot. Hand on top. Press forward. Bend at the hips. Press the shoulders down. Take a deep breath in and out. You should feel the stretch through the outer thigh. Hold right here, place the foot down. We're gonna go into a lunge on the side of the chair. Slight rotation in the pelvis. Bring the hands here in front and stretch it straight up above you. Open up the chest and press the shoulders down and back. Take a deep breath in and out. Open the arms up to shoulder level and stretch that arm and reach it up and over away from you. And open the arm up. Palms down. Rotate towards the front. Shoulders down and extend. Lengthen out. Take a deep breath in and out. Place the hand down on the chair and stretch it up and over. Can you feel that stretch through the side? Feels so good. Relax. Bring it down. Bring the feet in. And you're going to slowly roll over. Let your hands slide along the legs. And slowly uncurl up. Come back to center. Bring your knee into your chest, left side. And hold it right here. Lift your chest. Press your shoulders down and back. Take a deep breath in and breathe out. Extend the leg out to the front and feel the stretch underneath the thigh. Shoulders down. Can you feel that? You're going to lift it up and lower down. Lift and hold and lower down. One more time. Lift and hold. Now slowly circle the foot around. Reverse. Hold it here. Bend the leg. Knee turn out. Hand wrapped around the foot. Press down. Bend at your hips. Open up through your chest. And shoulders press down and back. Take a deep breath in. And breathe out. Uncross the legs and let's take it into the lunge. Slight pelvis rotation. Bring the arms in front and stretch it up. Now open up your chest and press your shoulders down and back. Open the arms out to shoulder level and stretch it up and over. Feels good. Open it up, turn your palms down, and rotate towards me. Drop your shoulders and really extend. Reach it out. Hand placed down on the chair. Lift it up and bring it back. And open it up. Bring your feet in and slowly round forward. Come all the way up. Come back to the center. And just lift your shoulders up and roll back. It's so important to stretch it out. It helps to relax the mind and the body. Thanks for working out with me. You are on your way to those sexy abs and those nice and toned, shapely arms. If you do this workout four times a week, you will see change in 30 days. If you want to work on lower body, I would recommend my 30 days to thinner thighs videotape. I want to help you look fabulous. Everybody's going to take notice, child. So 
What I'd like for you to do, most importantly, is not just to believe in me, but to believe in yourself.